Yeah, yeah, we back. We're here with M5. You just heard his song, Run the Club. Yeah. Now, is that is that or are you getting it on the airway? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm grinding right now, you know. Right. So everything is a grind, man. Just trying to stay above water. Cool. Stay, you know, yeah. factor to the streets with these videos and this producing this music and everything, man. How long have you been rapping? Oh, I've been rapping for like a year now. Being a director and behind the scenes, to, you know, bec- trying to become an artist now. You know what it was? I'm like, okay, now nowadays, right now, you gotta be upfront to be seen. You understand what I'm saying? To mm-hmm. be more noticed, because it's like back in the days, you you, you you can play the back position and be okay, but nowadays it's like you gotta be up there and doing doing a lot of this and a lot of that to be seen, and then you fall back onto your mm-hmm. your craft what you really want to do so that's what I'm doing I'm just having fun I'm just like doing everything man. like just something going to pop you know what I'm saying mm-hmm. do you think that Hype Williams would say the same thing cause he's like you know I mean the king of you're right, you're right, right and um everybody got their own different mm-hmm. reasons and ways on how how to make it work you know what I'm saying some people just get breaks and and it just happened, and then some people got to grind out for 10 years and 20 years for them to pop. So I, did you always want to rap? No. No, I it remember, just that came about. Yeah, I remember when uh, it was a point when I used to ask Rex, like, yeah, man, how you do it? Man? Like, <laughs> how you just come up with these things, man? He just was like, yo, man, the first, the first ball, man, that come out your mouth should just be crazy. And then everything falls into place from there. Mm-hmm. So once I mastered that, I learned it, excuse me, I just did it. Then as you know, mm-hmm. I started letting my peoples hear it, and they all saying, like, yo, you, you, you got better, like, you got you got something. Well, you know you have to freestyle on this show, right? Are you Y'all not ready? You're not ready? Like that. You're not ready? Y'all gonna put me on the spot like that. <laughs> you, listen, you gotta come You're prepared when you hear it, like. Let me, let me film something first. <laughs> All right, so we'll what audience that. do you um make your music for? I do um both. I got the uh, I deal with uh, kids because I used to be a dancer at one point. Mm-hmm. So I was the shake in the life feet world. We're I was, gonna talk about that. Excuse me. So let me go to <laughs> the whole um. I mean, you can give us the background now because we we know that you were an original shaker. Well, we got a caller. Let's listen to that caller. All right, let's see what's going on over here. You got here. a caller? I think we have like three. Wow, you popping. Was that That's the Twitter? That That's, I don't know. I mean, three PMS calls? Radio. Hello? Are they there? Oh, no. oh they ain't Next. Aw. What are going to say? Aw. Call back. 212 Yeah, we want to talk to you. 3437. Let's get back into your... Oh, I think we have a caller. Let's get back into your dancing. Yeah. So you were one of the originators of the yes. Harlem Shake? Yes. So for those who don't know, 